Guys, look at this. Look at it. Who's driving the Range Rover? <laughs> For the first time in years, the real Slim Shady drives a Range Rover. <laughs> How you like it? Nice car. <laughs> but it's a nice car. I always feel like I'm in a music video when I'm in those Range Rovers. Ah, yeah. But it's been used in a lot of music videos, isn't it? Yeah. The Range Rover is also being used by a lot of British criminals, right? <laughs> well, you're sitting the next London to the biggest Mafia. one. The YouTube star. No, no, you're saying it wrong. YouTube star. <laughs> 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 Hello everybody, guys, we made major, I'm talking major upgrades to my bike. As you may or may not know, I am the proud owner of the nicest, the finest, the highest quality, the most beautiful bike on planet Earth. I have the Riesa Müller Delights GT Vario, which is my favorite bike by far. I think this is the most beautiful bike. If I was a bike, this would be me. Guys, I thought this bike was already perfect. Two days ago, we went to the bike shop that sold us the bike and we went in to see if everything was fine. So they checked everything. And in the meantime, I saw a really nice computer. Look at this, everyone. Oh my Lord, guys. Look at this cockpit area. I feel like a pilot on this bike. I wouldn't even call this bike no more. I look like I'm Batman on this bike. <laughs> look at this, guys. I also got an attachment for my phone. So now I can have the navigation system here. And then also I got this computer, which shows me the speed I'm going, the range I have, the battery lifetime. I can also look into how much money this bike saves me on average while cycling instead of driving your car. And this actually works really well because you have to put in all your information of your car. So it calculates how much money you're saving while cycling. Isn't that the coolest Jewish feature out there? <laughs> this segment used to be a phone holder only. So I didn't even have this computer at all. They rearranged the whole cockpit. I now have this computer that lets me like see all sorts of things. I can also watch the weather this tracks all the information that I have while cycling and it's a really a really nice to have I think this is the coolest looking one because this shows me how fast I'm going it also shows me the range shows me what mode I'm in battery lifetime and then I have the navigation next to me or I can just watch my own YouTube videos I'm obviously kidding guys I would never do that on a bike in one of my last videos I showed how bad the alarm system worked and the company reached out to me and they were like this actually is a mistake Mistake. it should not be like that this never happens and so what we did is we ordered the lock again but now we ordered a longer lock because the one that I had before was a little bit short in my opinion I couldn't really attach the bike to objects with the lock because the lock was a little bit too short so now we got a new lock that is longer and that actually works properly and also besides that I got another separate alarm system which is this this is very nice because all I have to do is just press this button and then this is an alarm system on its own which means that if the bike starts moving this will go off i think it looks cool but this is a little bit too obvious so what i'm going to do is i'm going to take this alarm system detach it from this location and attach it under the basket so that when a person passes by they don't see it so now my alarm setup is this alarm system underneath the basket where nobody can see it and then also this lock that i use to attach my bike to an object and yeah that's the new changes guys isn't that insane i thought the bike was already perfect now i got an even better cockpit area and now i got the perfect not perfect but like a very good alarm system solution i truly believe that any alarm system is beatable here's a fun fact in the netherlands there's more bikes than people there's more bikes than dutch people in the netherlands the reason is that they all have two bikes they have one bike which is their their really nice bike and then there's one bike to go out with so if they go out they use the bike the cheap bike that's the secret if you really want to be sure that your bike doesn't get stolen leave it at home and have a second bike just like the people in the netherlands do <laughs> 
So yeah, guys, to round things up one more time, we got the new phone holder in the perfect position. We got the new computer, very beautiful computer, perfect for the ride. Then we got the new lock that actually works and that is 120 centimeters instead of 90 centimeters, plus this alarm system, which I'm gonna attach under the basket so that nobody sees it. This is security at its peak everybody at its peak but yeah guys this is the upgrades isn't that insane look at this beauty some people told me the basket doesn't really look good excuse me i know how dare you this is the nicest basket in the world Guys, I have been so disappointed. Did you see the new iPhone 15? Yeah, yeah, titanium. I have the iPhone 11. I wanted to get the new iPhone for the past three years. It's the exact same phone once again. But it's titanium now. People still come up to me and they're like, yo, do you have the latest phone? Because it looks the exact same. If I get the new iPhone, I want the new iPhone to say, look at me. I am the new iPhone. They could put a fourth camera on the iPhone that doesn't even work and I would get the new iPhone. I, I would know. straight up buy it. I know, that's the type of guy you are. I know, I know. But as long as it looks the exact same way as mine does, I'm not buying it. No, but now the new one, the, the pro one is titanium. George doesn't know how to drive, look at this. I know how to drive, it's just I want to let these people go first. <laughs> You are supposed to go first. I know, but... Guys, we're currently on our way to our favorite shopping center of all time. It's called DM. It's a German store. And they sell by far the best... Protein bar. Protein bar, yeah, like a chocolate alternative. It literally tastes like chocolate. It's a chocolate protein bar. It's by ESN. Guys, it changes, it changes everything. They have three protein bars that I am obsessed with. As you guys know, we are on our roads to get six packs. One of our biggest guilty pleasures is chocolate. And this chocolate- Why, because, because, because you're, 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 because you're like a woman on a period. This chocolate bar changes everything because it's healthy. I don't know if it actually is healthy, but it's much healthier than a regular chocolate bar. It's a protein bar with chocolate in it. Yeah, and it tastes delicious. Look, we just got to the place. This is it. What does, the M, what does it stand for, DM? Do you know? I have no idea. I tried, to, I tried to look it up, couldn't find it. Maybe dermatologists? Guys, we're here. We're finally here. We're gonna go get the chocolate bars, get the protein bars, and then we'll see you again in this car. Guys, we just came back. We got three protein bars. This one, one of my favorites. ESN designer bar fudge brownie. It tastes just like a brownie. It tastes so good. Then my second favorite is also by ESN, also designer bar, and the flavor is peanut caramel. And then George's favorite is this one. It's by Food Spring Protein Bar Extra Chocolate White Chalk Almond. So these are the three we're getting. This changes everything. Guys, since being on the road to a six pack, we both realized that I'd say like almost 80% of the results is just by dieting because we have been working out like mad men before, but we didn't really see results until we changed our diet. Chocolate was one of the biggest guilty pleasures that we had and replacing this these protein bars that taste so good is a game changer. Talking about another game changer. Uh All right. Here we go. Not we got this changer. one. Yeah. I'm gonna oh, eat this one. Thank you. I'm gonna eat this one. George's gonna eat that one. And then let's see. This already smells so good. Get that one. Get that one. Mm. This completely replaces chocolate, in my opinion. I like this more. Yeah. Yeah, me too. Chocolate. I would still need a whole regular chocolate bar just to feel guilty about it, but... Guys, now we're doing half-half on this one. Cheers. Cheers. Lechaim. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. I like it. Mm -hmm. A friend of mine told me that ESN also brought out stuff for cereals. So if you really like eating cereal in the morning, they also have cereal alternatives that are like high of protein, less sugar, probably. You can order them on ESN.com. I am sponsored by ESN, all right? I am their new face. I am their new athlete. Show me the money. I got it from ESN. They pay me in snacks, and that's all I need. Come on, this is a good snack, no? It is a fucking good snack. <laughs> it's an amazing snack. All right, everybody. Thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. It's been a great week. Next vlog is going to be sick because next vlog, we are going to the Bayern Munich Stadium. <laughs> Hey, all right, guys. This was the vlog. Uh, what do you always say? Elite vlog, elite vlog. <sighs> all right, guys. This was the vlog. 
I hope you enjoy it. Um, I am Eli T Vlog. This car is Eli T Vlog. This field over here that you cannot see is Eli T Vlog. The sky over here, the trees, they're all Eli T Vlog. This over here for sure is Eli T Vlog. I'm not Eli T Vlog. I'm Zora. Am I allowed to sit here then? Why am I not in the trunk? Get in the trunk. You know what button to press so that the trunk opens? <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> this is way too modern for me. It's Smart. a special button. It has your face on it. <laughs> this is comfortable. I know. This is actually nice because it's so far away from you. All right, everybody. Thank you all for watching. My name is Ilati Vlog. Peace. Peace. <laughs> you know how to open this again? No. <laughs> Which button do I push? Oh my God. Thank the Lord. I can't believe you always spend time in here. It's the best place. Oh. Christina, come to Israel. I miss you. Motherfucker.